1 Lesson 1 Memories of Previous Life You are listening at FameTV.info Dean, Nisferatu Dudditz, Immortal Mage, who lives 200 years, the Vampire King, Vampire Road, who uses blood as a medium of witchcraft and it was the name of, the lonely demon king living in Deep Mountain, dot no one knows when the magician was born, all I know is that he lives in an ancient castle on the border and continues his research unwittingly. As the name of immortality suggests, living 200 years remains young. It is also said to follow demons as relatives and secretly crave the world. The enigmatic, immortal, lord equals of, smiley face mage, Nisferatu, Dean. That's what they called me, too. I was finally about to come to an end. Well done. You made it this far. Lyle, Carmain. I said to whoever opened the door and came in, this is me, Dean. Nisferatu's castle. Between the depths that it is a large stone room with carpets on the floor. Were you here? Demon King. Dean, Nisferatu, coming in is a man like you can say he's young then my age is in my late twenties. He is holding the sword with both hands what you're wearing are cloth clothes and leather armor. Her hair is blurred and her inert beard is stretched that I guess I haven't slept the whole time. My eyes are dilapidated and I have bears all around me that it's awesome to say brave that it's as good as the holy sword you're holding but I'm pretty sure he came here ready that I have to deal with that, too. You, sanctuary church dog. You're shaking. Still a brave man. You don't even have a sword. He also has a low back. So you seriously think you can kill this lonely demon king, Dean, Nisferatu? Come, good brave Lyle, Carmain. This Dean, Nisferatu will do everything in his power to deal with you. Foo, what's up? Did you cower? Still brave or you? He he, he he, he he. No. I'm kidding. Lyle, Dot, struck the holy sword on the floor, screaming. You're kidding me. Bullshit. Bullshit. Ah. What the hell is this farce? Farce. You're kidding, my lord. Why do I have to kill you? Don't cry, fool. Just pick up the sword. Just follow the scenario, Lyle. My lord, my lord, you made up your mind, didn't you? To convince the sanctuary church, you, the village chief, have the names, immortal mage, the vampire king, the lonely demon king, kill Dean, Nisferatu, what is the vampire king, vampire road? You've never breathed blood before. Well. I've never named myself a vampire, in the first place, but I'm sure I'm a different creature than a human being that I don't know when I was born that I already looked like this when I realized I was wandering the world that I don't get old because of my strong ability to absorb the magic that drifts around the world. Being born capable, I couldn't do anything about it myself. I have hundreds of times as much magic in my blood as I do in people that I never get old or sick because that's what goes around my body, vampires, was called because they used their blood as a study material for sorcery. My blood was a mass of magic, perfect for a magic catalyst that I came to this land 150 years ago, until then, 50 years had been a wandering life pursued and pursued. Honestly, I don't want to remember that I think it's the luckiest thing I've ever lived to find this ancient castle on the border. From then on it was a peaceful day. At the foot of the mountain where the ancient castle is, there were laid back people living and they accepted me normally. At some point I became the patron saint of the village and quietly continued my study of magic that I thought that life would go on forever. An outbreak of a certain plague changed everything. You're not bad at all. My lord. Lyle grips his fist and pours tears out. You are the patron saints of the village. Parents who do not age for us, family members, lords, teachers. You didn't do anything wrong. Why do you have to die? So don't cry. Don't be silly. You're the village chief and the parent of one child. This wouldn't have happened if death tattoo disease hadn't been endemic. You just protected the village, you sanctuary church guys. Dan. Lyle's guy, he's been a crybaby for a long time. Death tattoo disease is a disease that began to epidemic a year ago, 
when infected, something like a black crest emerges on both arms, causing high fever and death. Apparently, there have been thousands of deaths in the king's capital of this country. The Church of the Sanctuary, a powerful religious group in this country, also struggled to deal with it. He said that he preached that if he repented of sin, he would heal, told him to purify his body with holy water, and fed his patients. Still, there were no fewer dead, and in the Wang capital, he said, enough land to bury the dead. That that's not why the sanctuary church was criticized, they did their best, so people. Me, I have no complaints whatsoever. The problem is that not a single person died in our village. I and the village of Fira, where Lyle is, I took care of the infection thoroughly. First, as soon as I heard rumors of death tattoo disease, I isolated those suspected of infection from this castle, because I knew from past experience that epidemic diseases can often be airborne even the slightest fever pulled him away from the others anyway and I kept taking care of him until the fever went down that I don't have a human condition. It was a great way to get medical attention the villagers have the ability to purify the air. I made sure to put a filter made of lani mal grass on my mouth. Of course, I washed my hands thoroughly, thanks to this, there are only five infected people in the village. Zero dead, only Alice, who had the most severe symptoms. Lyle's daughter. Had to give me my blood to treat her, but things went well that I'm feeling better now, I'm back in the village. On the contrary, however, the village was blinded to the church of the sanctuary by the fact that not a single person died. The priests of the sanctuary church called Lyle, the village chief, and asked. How come there were no dead in your village? He said, they knew about me, and I, the monster, was just right for them to impersonate the blame. They said that I was wondering if immortal mage Dean Nesferatu spread death tattoo disease, that I was wondering if the village of Fira didn't bring out the dead because the immortal mage made the villagers' family members, Kenzaku, with evil sorcery. Church of the Sanctuary commanded the villagers of village of Fira. Kill Dean Nesferatu with this holy sword, if you are not made servants by evil sorcery. And with it shall be a sign that the village of Fira is clean, with royal approval. If you kill me, give me the testimony that village of Fira will be clean. Asa no. Go push. They sent their subordinate, Holy Knight, into the village when Lyle couldn't kill me, it was to punish the villagers. Asa result, Lyle, the village chief, came to kill me. Why would I, why would I? You have to kill my dear master, my lord. You, Re, you're probably our most precious family, but ah. You know, Lyle, what can I say to my daughter Alice? She won't ask me if I tell her I'm going to be your daughter. In law. Because that kid is just a little girl. When you grow up, you find a human companion. Yes, my lord. Run away. Church of the Sanctuary lets us try to deceive ourselves. At the end of the ancient castle is the mountain. To the guys at Sanctuary Church, you can't go that far. If they're after you, fight them, but we'll stop them. You, you know what Sanctuary Church is all about. Look, I shut up, the Church of the Sanctuary has a monopoly on powerful ancient magic and ancient objects, a powerful group of fighters, while must know what happens when you turn them against the enemy. If you let me get away with it, you'll be in a position to be chased. Even the villages and towns around you will be enemies of Village of Fira. Ugh, that's enough. Give it up and kill me. Lyle, Carmaine. I don't have time, footsteps are approaching. Much. It would be the holy knights that it's a small castle. Is it the limit of time for the villagers? Damn, the door of the room opened and the holy knights of the church of the sanctuary jumped in. It's the lonely demon king, Dean Nesferatu. We, the holy knight, give you the hammer. Ha! Huh. In response to the voice of the holy knight, while erected the holy sword. Now. You think you can beat this Dean Nesferatu, you gratuitous saint. They'll give this villager a blood festival to start with. I jumped up into the air, Lyle looks at me. Open your eyes that I'm falling over Lyle like I'm wearing IT that as my heart hits the tip of my sword, and. That's surprisingly painful. Lyle's holy sword was sure to pierce my chest, excellent, dot. My lord, my lord. 
Hey. Don't cry, silly, well, that wasn't a bad life that I never had a child, but I could do something like family, the last time I failed, failing to live in hiding, the giant tissue caught my eye, and I couldn't help but hunt him down, but okay. Enough is enough. You've put me through so much trouble. Don't waste it. All right. Okay. Ugh, ugh, to my last instruction, Lyle nodded silently. All right, pushing Lyle's shoulder, I left him. That's right, brave man, I said that at that moment, there's blood all over my mouth, ouch, really, after all, I just don't get old, I wasn't immortal. If you get stabbed with a sword, you bleed, and if you get fatally injured. You die them why consciousness fades. My vision. Blurs that I can't see Lyle all over my blood and his holy sword. Lyle. You still have something to do. You're not confused, get ready. Breathe in, scream. There you go. Then the evil sorcerer Dean, Nisferatu was defeated by the village of Fyra, village chief Lyle, Carmaine a a a a a a a a a a a a well done, Lyle that I left the rest to you. That's it for me, next up is my own. Do what I have to do. Unfold magic. Free the soul from the flesh. I started the magic I was ready for that I knew this would happen. Subsequent measures were put in place that there's a bat at the window. There, from now on, I will sever my soul from my flesh and transplant it into the bat of the demon of use and in doing so, I'm going to keep living in him. Hakanyaba. It's faster than I thought. My consciousness disappears, soul transplant magic. Well. Use it. A failure, Ginger. No, you keep failing. Really, I am, you should have known more about humans. Before this happens, that way, without involving the Lyles. In peace. If there's a way to study humans properly and live like that. Are you reincarnated? I heard a voice. You satisfied the reincarnation condition for. Rebirth is possible as. Once again in this world. Will you be reincarnated? If possible, I answered unexpectedly. Confirmed consent of person, my voice, slowly, disappears. No, is it my consciousness that disappears? I will reincarnate you as a human being. And finally, my consciousness was broken. See you later, did you put the last word in your mouth, or did you just think so, you just felt like Lyle nodded at it, even now, I don't know that I remembered that on my tenth birthday point three years after I regained my memory of my previous life. My age now is thirteen. Born again as the second son of the Baron family, this is how I still live. Listen to the full novel at fametv.info, direct link in the description.